I was just coming off of a Sting illustration from WCW Sting. Uh, that's what's ghosted in the background there. And uh, a buddy of mine on Facebook, he said, oh my gosh, if you do an illustration of Ultimate Warrior, um, I will totally take a print of that. And then I thought, well, why didn't I do Ultimate Warrior to begin with? I was a big WWF kid uh, growing up, and so I should have just done that first. But Sting jumped out at me. Anyhow, um, I want to keep these guys really squatty and fat and just looking like little kind of monsters slash mutants or something like that. After sketching it out, the initial drawing is kind of done and I figure out what I want to do in terms of color. I will usually go dark to light first. So I'll take like the almost the darkest dark that I'm going to use for the body and the other colors on him, the hair. And I'm going to render up from that render, meaning paint it up to kind of reveal the form and that kind of thing. At the very end, I'll end up going back in and doing a highlight um, that will kind of brush over the top of things. And then a very dark, um, darkest shadow. Now here I'm able to start picking out some of the details. I really just wanted him to be like gross and veiny and, and suit, like abnormally muscular. And so I'll pick out some of the little um, veins in his chest and biceps and um, in his um, arms and head and everything just so that I can get this like really gross looking um, overly pumped dude. And I keep going back and forth to my um, reference material too, which is important. Always do that. I'm picking out the little details and this thing's just about finished. If you dig this illustration and you kind of want to see more of this kind of stuff, I do these kind of things all the time. You can find me at It's Bill Main or It's Bill Main Art.com. <laughs>